Hey guys, it's Anne. Welcome to the channel. Today we're going to be sifting out one of my leftover bins and hopefully we're going to get some worms for our new project. So this is my quarter inch screen that I use for just about everything. And so my goal today is to sift out the part that still needs to be done and then also get worms for my new project. And everything that doesn't fit through the screen that's not a worm is going to go back in the leftover bin. I don't expect to find a lot of worms right here on top because it's been drying for quite some time. I do expect to get a pretty decent harvest out of this. been uh, left to its own devices for a couple of months. You don't have to do this sifting like I do. I just do this, um, I don't know, because I always do. But for me, rather than wait for a bin to be 100% ready, I would rather take the part that is not done and give some other worms a chance to finish it off and then I can start a new bin fresh. Let's see, did I find a sticker? I did, I found a sticker. So when this goes through the one quarter screen, which is what it's doing right now, much of it can go through the even smaller screen, which is one eighth or one twelfth, and I can pick out the cocoons. And if you're wondering, why would I sift twice? Well, for the most part, uh, just simply because it's very um, difficult to do large volumes through a small screen. It's very time consuming and it's easier to get the bulk of it, which is probably like 50%, to go through first. Works a lot better if you don't put as much in the screen. Otherwise it clogs everything up. we go. We've got all of our harvested castings. Um, and I will just kind of use this as a, a nursery as well. So let me grab them some food. I've got three little baby oranges here. I'm just going to break them open, stick them pretty close to the top here. And then any baby worm that decides to hatch in here will have some place to go. Now this is all nice and fluffy and aerated, so I am okay to shut this, but I will come back every week and check on them, and if there's any babies, I will release them. I've got quite a few of these going, actually. I don't have a playlist for this. Let me know if you think this would be worthy of having a playlist. Harvesting, I can put this in my harvesting castings uh, playlist. So I will link that below. If you like this video, give it a muddy thumbs up. If you're not a member of my worm family, click that subscribe button. And if you want to know what I'm doing when I'm doing it, ring that bell icon. 
Alright guys, thanks for hanging out with me and my worms and everybody. Have a good day.